The modern mechanical refrigerator works on the principle that a liquid absorbs heat when it turns to a gas. The gas carries away heat during evaporation, leaving a cooled liquid behind. Since heat flows from warmer bodies to colder bodies, a vaporizing liquid cools objects that are in contact with it. Pressurized liquid refrigerant leaves a storage container under high pressure. It flows through a metering device containing a length of narrow tubing where the pressure drops and the liquid vaporizes into gas. As the gas enters the evaporator, it has a lower temperature than it did as a liquid. As the refrigerant passes through the coils of the evaporator, it absorbs heat and cools the inside of the cabinet. The low pressure refrigerant vapor is pumped into the compressor. The compressed vapor, now at an elevated temperature, flows at high pressure into the condenser. Here it is air cooled. As heat is transferred out of the refrigerant into the air, the gas returns to a liquid state. Warm air is expelled by the refrigerator. The refrigerant is collected in the storage tank, ready to begin another cycle of refrigeration. A thermostat, connected to a temperature sensor on the cabinet, controls the compressor and maintains a constant temperature inside the refrigerator.